During the clerkship year, School of Medicine students can use the OASIS mobile application on their phone or tablets to log requirement checklist items, and this short video is intended to show students how to set it up. We will pair your mobile device with your OASIS account, and then we'll set up the OASIS mobile application on your device. You start in OASIS by clicking on the requirement checklist link that's in the announcements portal. From the requirement checklist, top right, there is a link for your devices. The add new device link will allow you to add a device name like Mark's iPhone. And save the entry. You'll have one entry for each device that you add to your Oasis account. At this point, we have not paired the device with the account, but the system has generated a pairing key containing a unique string of letters and numbers. Take note of the school ID. In my case, I'm using a development system, so my school ID is UVA-dev. Yours will be different. You will need both the school ID and the pairing key when we set up your mobile device. The Oasis Scheduling Mobile app is available at both the Apple and Droid stores. Simply search in your appropriate store for the Oasis Scheduling Mobile application. It is written by Schilling Consulting LLC. Once you have downloaded the app from the appropriate store, we'll start it and we'll need to create a new profile. If you took notes in the Your Devices section from Oasis, you should be able to complete each prompt. Specifically, we'll need your school ID and your pairing key. So school ID, username, mobile pairing key. You'll need to create your own PIN number and confirm it. One thing to keep an eye out for is that the entry of each of these fields is case sensitive. So you might get an authentication failure due to the first character capitalization behavior that we see you know, typically on our mobile devices. The profile does have a couple of options that you might want to consider. The save automatically feature does exactly what it sounds like. Setting this option on causes the data entries to be saved as you go and avoids the need to initiate a separate sync or synchronize operation to save the data to the OASIS server. Setting this option off might be useful in a situation where you do not have a consistent Wi-Fi connection or good wireless connectivity and need to use the application offline. The save over cellular option can be set accordingly to help you manage your wireless data consumption. Once you've completed it, just create the profile, and the Oasis mobile app will pull up a mobile-friendly list of the re same requirement checklist that you would see on a laptop or desktop computer that is logged into Oasis. A couple of usability notes. You will need that PIN number anytime you switch away from the mobile app and return to it. Secondly, each time you log out of the application, know that you'll have to provide the school ID, your username, and your PIN.
In this video, we went over the steps of configuring your Oasis account for a mobile device and configuring the Oasis mobile application on your device. Using the application is fairly intuitive, assuming that you have entered requirement checklist before. Should you need a short tutorial, there are two additional videos showing you how to complete Oasis checklist on a mobile device, as well as completing an Oasis checklist on your laptop. Should you have any questions, feel free to contact us at mededweb at virginia.edu. Alternatively, you should be able to find one of us in our respective offices in the Learning Studio, the Auditorium, or the Health Sciences Library.